Would you believe it if you were told that Turkey has joined the elite group of nations that have successfully flown a functional sixth-generation fighter jet? Yes, you heard it right. On the 21st of February 2024, the Turkish skies witnessed a new marvel, the Khan. Piloted by test pilot Barbados Demirbus, this sixth-generation fighter jet soared to an altitude of 8,000 feet and reached a top speed of 230 knots. This 13-minute flight, which concluded successfully at the Murdered Airfield Command in North Ankara, marked a significant milestone in global military aviation. By achieving this feat, Turkey has positioned itself alongside world powers such as the United States, Russia, and China, nations whose military prowess is backed by their trillion-dollar economies. This is not just a milestone for Turkey but a game-changer for the global military aviation landscape. Let's delve into the details. On February 21, 2024, a new bird soared the skies for the first time. A day etched in history, as the Turkish sixth-generation fighter jet Khan took to the heavens in its maiden flight. The stage was set at the Murdered Airfield Command in North Ankara. The air was thick with anticipation. As the engines roared to life, hearts raced in unison. With a surge of power, Khan detached itself from the Earth's grasp. The maiden flight had begun. Ascending swiftly into the blue expanse, Khan reached an impressive altitude of 8,000 feet. The world beneath became a mosaic of colors and shapes, a testament to the heights this innovative marvel had achieved. Then, the throttle pushed further, the engines responding with a surge of power. The speedometer needle raced ahead stopping only at a blistering top speed of 230 knots. The skies had welcomed a new contender. For 13 minutes, Khan danced in the air, a ballet of technology and innovation, a symphony of power and precision. Agile, swift and powerful, it was a sight to behold, a spectacle that demonstrated the prowess of Turkish aviation. Then, as gracefully as it had ascended, Khan began its descent. The ground rushed up to meet it and with a gentle touch, the wheels kissed the runway. The maiden flight had concluded. It was back at the same airfield from where it had started this historic journey. But Khan was not the same. It had flown. It had conquered. It had proven its mettle. Piloted by test pilot Barbados Demirbus, Khan's successful flight has etched a new chapter in the annals of military aviation. A chapter written with courage, determination, and a relentless pursuit of innovation. Today, Khan is not just a fighter jet, it is a symbol of Turkey's audacity to dream, to dare, and to soar high into the endless sky. The successful flight of Khan is not just a national achievement but it has a global impact. This event has shaken the pillars of the global military aviation landscape, a field previously dominated by the likes of the US, Russia, and China. With Turkey's entry the status quo has been disrupted and the game has a new player. Turkey's achievement underscores the fact that innovation and technological advancement aren't the exclusive domains of trillion-dollar economies. It sends a clear message to the world, that with determination, vision, and a commitment to excellence, any nation can make its mark on the global stage. This development has global ramifications. It alters the dynamics of military aviation, potentially shifting power balances and influencing geopolitical strategies. Other nations inspired by Turkey's success, might also aspire to join this elite group, further adding to the complexity and competitiveness of the sector. With Khan, Turkey has proven that it's not just the trillion-dollar economies that can make a mark in the world of military aviation. As we wrap up, let's revisit the key points of this remarkable achievement. On February 21st, 2024, Khan, Turkey's sixth-generation fighter jet, soared into the skies for the first time. Piloted by test pilot Barbados Demirbus, Khan took off from the Murdered Airfield Command in North Ankara, reaching an altitude of 8,000 feet and a top speed of 230 knots. The flight lasted 13 minutes and marked a new chapter in Turkey's military aviation history. This successful maiden flight catapulted Turkey into an elite group of nations that have successfully flown a functional fifth-generation fighter jet. Previously, this exclusive club consisted only of the US, Russia and China, all world powers backed by trillion-dollar economies. The broader implications of this achievement are far-reaching. Khan's successful flight signifies a shift in the global landscape of military aviation, breaking down the barriers that once limited this field to a select few nations. As Khan soars the skies, it's clear that the world of military aviation is no longer the exclusive domain of a few. It's a new dawn, a new day, and for Turkey, a new high in the skies.